Hello, Shane. I hope you're doing well. Uh, I've been thinking about you. Uh, this will be some video feedback for Milestone 2, uh, the animated banner. Uh, you really excelled on this, too. And so I wanted to um, commend you on that. Uh, don't forget to document your process. Um, you'll be required to have a illustrated narrative uh, this week, in week 7, which will be the third part of this um, the final reflection. But good going, I bid you strength, and um, I'll, this will be my last feedback, video feedback to you. Shane, this is great. Um, I, I, like, I like the bevel box. It you know, gives it a little bit of three dimensions, three dimensionality. Um, I like what you've done with the logo. And uh, the addition of this type, which is, you know, I think we've discussed this before. It's not necessarily Amethyst Bay um, type style, but it is, um, I think, pleasing against the other types, typefaces that you've chosen. Uh, you've used the corporate palette really well. Uh, you've got everything on, <clears throat> including your effects, on layers. So, you know, if I didn't like, say, the, the bevel, I can turn that off or on, can I? Um, perhaps while, I'm, well, probably not while it's running, and <clears throat> you've also figured out the timeline editor, and you've got uh, you varied the time between frames. Um, you might also consider doing uh, tweening. You know, you might that allows things to phase in or, or fade in, fade out. Um, and one other recommendation would be maybe not have the border. Okay, bleeding the photographs like that photo could be the entire background of the rectangular banner shape. Um, you, I suggest you know, maybe also bleeding off uh, those smaller images. Maybe they could go off the edge uh, without the border. But it's just, you know, keep your, keep your mind open to changing it. I know we're all pressed in one way or another, <clears throat> and uh, redoing something <clears throat> is not on the top of anyone's list. And I'm not suggesting that you do that. But um, if you could, if you wanted to improve this, <clears throat> and um, it's perfectly acceptable as it is, uh, I would work on the typography and the perhaps the composite, the general composition. You've got the requisite information on it, though, and I commend you for that. Shane, I'm, I'm going to leave it here, um, and uh, I look forward to seeing your final. Uh, once again, you know, don't. You met the requirements of the of the final rubric too, so you don't need to extend yourself unless you're able and have the time. And um, <clears throat> I don't want you to stress. All right, take care.